guys, how's it going? So I just went to Home Depot, or actually Lowe's, to go get some more supplies for our drip irrigation. While I was there, I ran into some peach trees and they were super tall. And you know, I wanted to replace this one that died to mirror this side. So that one is a Peach Florida Dawn. And this one is a Peach Florida Queen. So I'm going to set this up, get it in the ground, and I'm going to take you along with me. If you guys hear my kids, they are home from school and they are playing right here in the background. Huh? <laughs> That's right. We're planning it, bub. Huh? We're planning it. Planning? <clears throat> yeah, it has to go in the ground. Well, yeah. Go. Wagon. I'm gonna make sure I have it centered correctly. Which way do I want to? I think I want it to it. Right. Are you going to measure it? Hey. How big is it, bub? Huh? How big is it? Good. That's good? Uh-huh. Good. Good size? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Good size. Good size. Well, All right, let's go see. So now that we have it planted, I'm going to go ahead and pull that off. Um, I'm going to leave these for now, but we're going to go ahead and give it a little drink. You want to water it? I wanted to, <laughs> I wanted to hurry up and get this planted before my husband came home because every time I go to Lowe's or Home Depot, I come back with a plant. So we're being sneaky, huh? All right, water it in. No, my head. Okay, okay. You gotta move it around, remember? Move it. Okay. Yeah, silly. Alright, you gotta keep it moving. Watch your shoes. Alright, 
right. You put that water hose down. Watch that ant. Watch that ant pile. for this video. It was a quick and easy little uh, peach tree tutorial on us getting it in the ground and ready for spring. Yeah. You want to come say bye? Come on, come say bye. Bye. <laughs> okay, bye. Bye.